three, two, one, and timber. Okay, you fell the wrong way. Want to keep up with the latest Garrett Plays videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Yo, yo, people, get you in here for another video. So, guys, this video is going to be in Farming Simulator 19, and we are going to be working for a tree trimming surface, um, but it also might be a power surface because I'm looking at the vehicle. It says power uh, source on it, right? So, I don't know. May maybe it's kind of like a mixture, um, but either way, so we're trimming down trees, and... Uh, for a few different reasons, right? One reason is some of the trees need to be trimmed down or just because they're gonna be turned into like power lines um, So obviously that's where you get the power source from But then some of the trees are also gonna be uh, just cut down because they're blocking too much sunlight uh, Or maybe they're actually just blocking um, important like pathway that people need to walk on or drive on, right? So lots of different reasons why we're gonna be cutting these trees down, but either way Let's go ahead, we're right now driving over to my little barn. Uh, and I say little barn because when you see the size of the vehicles that are inside it, you're just gonna question how I got them in there. Uh, it's just up ahead, right by where that tow truck service is. But either way, so we're gonna be driving there and then getting some, uh, probably the medium size or maybe even the large size vehicle to drive today just cause this thing honestly is just not not big enough it's good for little small jobs uh especially like i don't know if power lines are connected to houses and stuff but for what we're doing today this thing definitely does not does not suffice <laughs> so either way let's go ahead right here's the barn i'm talking about now i get okay it looks pretty big it honestly does um but again when you see inside you're gonna think differently so it's lots of just dead space too, right? Okay, so look at the size of this vehicle. This is our small one. And if you compare it to, I don't know, the size of like that door, right? It's, it's a little bit, a little bit tight, but it fits in there, no issue. But now we go inside and yeah. Okay, so we have both of these. So this is our medium size. Now, if we compare this to the size of this little thing, right? See a pretty big difference. Like look at the arm, for example, right? The arm goes out longer and this uh, first extension, look at how short this is, right? But if we go to this one, it's like, I don't know, five times that length uh, and it goes very far over the hood and everything. It's pretty intense. And then the large one, well, this one, it extends out quite a bit. That's absolutely crazy. It doesn't even have the same material because, I don't know, I guess it's just too big. <laughs> so let's go ahead. I guess we'll hop in the large one today. Here we go. Let's drive on out of here. Now, I'm going to try putting uh, the small one, the small vehicle in here. I believe it's an F550. Let's let's see what it says. Uh, yeah, F550 Super Duty. We're going to put that in there. The only concern is sometimes when we do this, we're going to like get stuck in the ceiling. Hopefully that doesn't happen. We will, we will see. I'm going to try. I think I have an idea. I think if we park like on this angle, we should be good. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so sometimes what happens is we get stuck in that floor, but it's not an issue today. <laughs> okay, let's close up the barn for safety. And now we can get on the road and start, start with the actual tree trimming. So we're going to go on the highway. We're heading to the city because that's where uh, lots of the trees are. And I'm going to give you guys a heads up. Some of the trees, actually, I think all the trees today are palm trees. Now, I personally love the way palm trees look. I guess not everyone does, or for whatever reason, palm trees are what we're going to be cutting down. Um, so it's kind of sad, especially like cutting the tops off palm trees. It just, it ruins the way the tree looks, right? That's literally the coolest part of the tree. Um, but we got paid to do this, and I don't know. We're, we're gonna go ahead and do it <laughs> so yeah just a fair warning there but anyways here we go uh also i just quickly want to say guys oh look at this view okay we can chill up here for a sec um this is kind of weird <laughs> but yeah something i want to say guys is we do have a very big change with our merchandise so we used to be with represent.com uh for lots of reasons which i listed in a recent video i believe yesterday's video actually um yeah either way so 
we switched over now to Teespring and Teespring does very good prints. They have lots of high quality options, which I've selected for the merchandise and uh, really fast shipping and cheap shipping for the US, really fast shipping for the UK and everywhere around there, right? So it's really, really good. Um, but yeah, so also I got lots of new designs on the merchandise store because I wanted to wanted to not just like reskin everything, right? So got lots of new uh, designs and then on top of that here, this is our first one right here, by the way, these trees right now. Um, but yeah, on top of that, you guys can use code NATION N-A-T-I-O-N for 10% off all the merchandise up until January 8th. So that's a Wednesday if you guys if you guys didn't know. Uh, but yeah, the code worked until then. So it's Code Nation for 10% off all the merchandise. Anyways, let's go ahead and unfold this. Perfect. And we will bring up this arm. So for these ones, we're cutting off the tops, I believe because of power lines that are going to be going in here. Um, again, I'm not not quite sure when it comes to these trees, but here can we switch actually? Yeah, this view. That's gonna be pretty useful, I think. There we go. Now these have some terrible collision on them. Um, like technically, we're kind of hitting the tree right now, even though we're pretty far from it. So, yeah, I don't know. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and start cutting this. So, okay, we have this leaf just in our way. Uh, let's angle it like that. Yeah, okay. There we go. Three, two, one, and timber. Okay, you fell the wrong way. Um, That's okay. Now what I want to do is we're going to cut this flat. So actually, in order to do that, I probably want to lower down a bit. So we're going to have to jump out. It's the only way to do it. And let's go like this maybe. Okay, and then you just cut this completely straight. And I did—I cut it initially on an angle because I wanted to make sure that... Okay, well, that's as straight as we're going to get. Um, I wanted to make sure that the tree wasn't going to like fall towards us or anything like that. So that's why we had to go kind of at an angle. Uh, but yeah, okay, let's hop on out. Let's get into here and let's fold this down. There we go. And okay, so I'm gonna drive over um, to the next location. We're actually gonna leave that one. I just checked what it said. We're leaving that other tree. There was only that one tree we had to remove. So either way, we're gonna drive over to the next location. And when I'm doing that, here is a message from our sponsor. Join Lava Mod's Patreon page to instantly receive access to some amazing modern creations. You will get early access to Lambo, Winston, and Beardshot's awesome ideas. On top of all that, you will get cool textures and other unique modding tools. Join today using the link below. Okay guys, we are at our next location. Um, yeah, it's actually right here. So the reason we're cutting these trees down, there's actually two sections of trees we have to cut down. Uh, the first one is right up here. And the reason for that is because you see how there's a flag from quite a few angles. Uh, it's They're being blocked. So we're leaving this tree and we're leaving this tree. Uh, but this tree right here, we need to cut it so it is like lower than the flag, right? So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to definitely need our supports. This tree is quite a bit taller than the last one. So this is going to be a little bit crazy. <laughs> here we go. Uh, okay, let's start actually bringing up the arm. Uh, okay, I think probably now we should get some kind of supports going. So... Um, or here, let's drive. Where, where do we need to be? I think here. Okay. Bring out the supports. There we go. And then let's switch camera angles. Perfect. There we go. Okay. So yeah, we're just cutting right underneath where the flag is. Nice American flag. Look at that, guys. Okay. There we go. Right about think right about here that's as close as we're gonna get okay let's hop on out and now we'll cut it down uh, again we're gonna angle it at first so we're gonna go like this this might take a second oh there we go oh geez that completely fell 
towards us. Uh, I did not hit our vehicle though. So that's all that matters. Let's hop on out though, and we're gonna lower this down. So yeah, right now it's actually hitting. You see our vehicle's kinda at angle. It is for whatever reason this class rise is it hitting. Um so yeah, we're gonna need to kind of play around with that. Okay, there we go. That should be good. And then we're just going to cut straight edge. Just like so. Alrighty. And then that can just fall this way. Alrighty. Did not mean to throw it that far, but it's all good. <laughs> Let's hop back down. And then we will fold this thing up. Just like so. Okay. Oh, actually, we got to turn it this way. I never know which way it turns. <laughs> Lower this down. Okay. Bring our supports in. And yeah, we're not cleaning up the tree from here. Uh, it's not our job. So we'll just leave it. Actually, here. You know what I should do? I'm going to move this out of the way. Just because that's a little... That's, I don't know. It's a bit dangerous. We can see if we can just shimmy this. I know that's not really realistic. Because that would be super heavy. But it's okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. So the next... Thing we need to do is cut the trees right here let's go ahead and back on up uh so yeah so the issue with these is they're just all grown together and it's just an issue so we're cutting off the tops of just these ones here uh just two of them i think or actually can we get away with just cutting one off mm, no no okay i'm looking at what it says it says we need to do two so let's bring out our supports There we go. Perfect. Okay, let's see where we where we are. Oh, that's pretty pretty good. And let's go ahead and cut this. Here, let's try just doing a straight angle. Let's see what that does. So I guess no angle at all. More wood. I I've cut down twenty five trees. Um, maybe on this map, but I've definitely done more than twenty five trees total. That's a weird achievement. Okay. Uh, yeah. Which one? It doesn't say which one to cut down. Uh, like, I'm just looking at our paper, guys. It doesn't say which one of the other two. So, just based off the way all these trees are, I'm going to say they probably want this one cut down because it's a little bit, like, out of place. So, can we reach it? Mm, no. All right. We'll go down here. Bring this over. Oh, jeez. Yeah, so although we aren't technically hitting it, the game thinks we are. We're going to have to keep a bit of a distance. Yeah, that classifies us hitting it. That's weird. Okay, there we go. I'll cut this one. Honestly, cutting it straight worked good last time, so let's try that again. Uh, which way is it going to fall? I guess it just won't fall, so let's push it. There we go. Nicely done, and think, think that's good. So we can fold this on up, uh, just like so. Oh, we gotta turn it around again. I keep forgetting that it goes that way. <laughs> and there we go. Okay, bring in our sports, and we're good to go. So we have one more job to do this video, and it's actually at a construction site right nearby. Uh, okay, we have a car accident here too. I'm going to turn off my lights because we are not allowed to use those when going down the street uh, until we're like actually at the location. Um, What happened here? Can I like, can I squeeze by? Ooh, this is risky. I know this thing has bad collision. Okay. Oh, what? Oh, no, okay, we're good, we're good. There we go. Um, here, can I help them? Is there anything I can do to help these people out? I don't think so. They are, like, they really got in a car accident. Alrighty. Yeah, that's not good. I hope, uh, they seem good. Like, they don't seem injured, so. That's all that matters. <laughs> we'll just, we'll just ignore that car accident. Alright, so, I see the construction site. Now, they said there's a lot of trees here. And to just cut down whatever I think makes sense. There's only one tree that they said I have to cut down, uh, and they said just to cut a few more down, um, just make it look nice. So, 
we will do that. There's one that's like blocking a path, and that's the main one they want cut down. Here we go. Okay. Now that we're closer, I can turn on my lights. It's also good that I turn them off because there's a cough right over there. <laughs> we would have gotten quite a bit of trouble. So yeah, here they are. So, uh, yeah, this one right here, the close one. Or, not the, cl like, here, I'll show you guys which one. This one right here. You see how it's, like, blocking the path? They want that one gone. Which makes sense. I don't know how they're bringing construction equipment in here with the way it currently is. Fold this out. Now we are kind of on the road, so I want to do this a little bit quick, if possible. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely a more risky, risky job to do. Okay, let's go in a basket and let's cut this here. Yeah, our job is not to cut down the full tree; they just need the tops off. And I think part of it too is the tops are so heavy. That even though I just chucked that, but the tops are obviously quite heavy. Uh, they, especially because this is, this is a construction site, they probably have the tools to cut down the rest of the tree. Probably just didn't have like a arm to get extended up like this. Uh, okay, we need to get this over here. There we go. Fold this down. Wait, now this is backwards. Whoops. Why did I think? Okay, you know what? It's okay for now because we are just going into here. Here we go. I'm going to have to move that uh, piece of tree though. Let's just huck this out of the way. Boom. Okay. Back on up. And yeah, so the next tree you probably can guess from looking. It's our last tree actually. This one right over here. It's in their construction zone. Uh, and yeah, it's just an issue. <laughs> so let's go ahead get rid of this thing this one's a little bit shorter or actually I guess the last one is pretty short too Let's unfold this there we go okay we can just go like this uh yeah okay let's go this view okay, right on over I like how the bucket stays flat that's one really cool thing with these vehicles just like so and for this, we definitely want to cut it on our land, or on their land, I should say. So we're going to angle it at first. Hopefully it falls in the inside of the fence. Come on, let's see. Uh, yes, it did maybe. Yeah, it did. Okay, we're good. Now what we need to do is lower this thing down a bit so we can cut this thing flat because no one wants a jagged tree uh, okay that's gonna have to do boom and nope don't fall don't don't fall go over there now you can fall perfect hop back in our vehicle and I think we are good so anyways guys thank you for watching this video if you guys did enjoy please drop a like and consider subscribing also, join our Discord server, links down below. Check out the merchandise on teespring.com slash store slash Garrett Plays. Uh, again, that will be linked. Uh, use code NATION, N-A-T-I-O-N, for 10% off all the merchandise until January 8th, 2020, not even 2019. It's 2020 now. Have a good day. You guys are awesome. Bye-bye. Want to play games with your friends? Grab a dedicated server from G Portal. Make sure to click the link down below to receive an instant 5% discount.